five shots his last seven games played, three goals his last two games played, and there's no question Johnny Gaudreau is back. And he will start with Monaghan and Backlund. Hannafin gets a return pass, carries in on the wing. Lindholm shoots the rebound. Great save, Reimer off Hannafin. What a stop by James Reimer. Now Giordano. Here's Kachuk. Side of the goal, Lindholm trying to jam it in. Reimer able to shut him down. Kachuk gets it back to the circle. Now Lopal Lindholm in front. Monahan stopped by Reimer. Monahan fishes it loose. And then back, and we'll just tie it up in the corner with 12 seconds of the power play. Here's Lindholm. Shoot, stopped by Reimer. Good look for Lindholm on the penalty kill. You know, when you produce numbers like that, sometimes you can get away with maybe not being as defensive minded. Here's a huge save by Riddick on a point blank chance. And away he goes. Johnny Gaudreau trying to work it in. Stolen by Natchez on a good play defensively all the way across. Svechnikov with a shot, and that's stopped by Riddick. Rebound cleared off of uh, Stahl, and it goes high. Boy, Rasmus Anderson just continues to improve, especially in the D zone. The other night against John Tavares. There's a steal. Flames get a chance. Ryan stopped by Reimer. Flipped out to center ice where Travis Hamannick waits. He makes a play to Kachuk. Nice drop pass to Lindholm with a bit of room and a shot, and Reimer makes the save. Rebound to Teravainen. Three Hurricanes to center. Ajo pass to Teravainen, tipped away by Mark Giordano. All the way around, McGinn spinning off the board to left the puck behind, and it comes out over the line. Rock back in. Here's a chance. Martin, a pass across McGinn, scores! On a giveaway at the Calgary line, Martin finds Brock McGinn who gets his third goal of the season and makes it a 1-0 game. And you can see Jankowski has the puck. He's unable to get it out, but good back pressure there by Goche. And watch just that little tip pass over to Martinik. And then over to McGinn, creates the two-on-one. But Goche was really the guy that kept this play alive and kept it going. As he out muscles Reader. After video review, it was determined that the play was onside. We have a goal. Wow. Play Hamilton to Aho. Carabine and back to Hamilton. That pass tipped away by Backman into the corner. Hamilton able to recover with a shot. And he scores! Dougie Hamilton off the glove of Riddick and in. It's a power play goal and it's 2 0 Carolina. Full team in their building and get this key power play goal and it's just good puck pursuit good puck pressure by Dougie Hamilton and this is just a shot on net that David Riddick has to have I mean there's not traffic in front you can see this from Hamilton's stick and he just misplays it Hayden Fleury plays it ahead Caravine and feeds it through here's Niederreiter right in stopped by Riddick and the rebound scooped up by Dubé Backlund Anderson, one-timer, stop, rebound, stopped as well. Two big saves by Reimer, and the loose puck's clear to center ice. Nook's clearing attempt, bounces across to Fogel, and away he goes. Fogel with a bit of room, Giordano comes back. Fogel fans then get the shot away and put it wide. Martin up to Fogel on the penalty kill. Fogel, pass in front, scores! Got his own rebound off the skate of Giordano and put it home. It's a shorthanded goal for Warren Fogel, and it's 3-0 Carolina. In the second period, really started to turn things around. You can see the turnover inside the Carolina Hurricanes blue line, and it leads to these opportunities. Vogel fans on a shot, but the Carolina Hurricanes able to keep it in, and this block shot, and Mark Giordano just goes right back to Vogel, and he ends up basically having a wide open net as Riddick was sliding to the right, thinking the pass was coming across. And Monahan lost the puck. Empty net for Terrabine, and that shot hit the back of the Flames defenseman, and then Fogel's able to put the rebound in for his second goal of the game. Another shorthanded goal, by the way. So Warren Fogel gets two shorthanded goals, one into an empty net. Well, Fogel just doesn't give up. He sees Mark Giordano, tries to block the, the first shot, and then he just can't find the puck, and he sticks with, with it. And look at Reimer's reaction. Svechnikov, they, they deserve these goals by Fogel, these shorthanded goals here. They've been good. So the first loss as head coach for Jeff Ward and Reimer, the former Red Deer Rebel, picks up his second shot of the season, 23rd of his career, with a 32-save performance.